Well, shake, rattle, and roll. We're on the road. Hello, everyone. Hello. Welcome back to another live with DD5. Heartland HQ with Deacon Tank and House. What's going on, Heartland? Sherry Fillmore, Petrus, John Evans, Joseph, Auntie Anne, Pam B. Hello, guys. Hello, everybody. <laughs> yeah, that's a huge cemetery. Mama Carolyn, hello. Hello. We are still in Oklahoma. Still. Still in Oklahoma. You know, it just can't go easy for us drifters over here. I'm not, uh, I can't look at the screen very, really, because I'm driving everybody, but uh, my queen, can you tell, I see Wesley done commenting. What's going on, Wes? Evening, fellas. Oh, sorry, guys, it's bouncing everywhere. <laughs> Hope y'all as well. Come on with, come on. Come on with, come on. Karen Carnegie, hello. Hello, Auntie Ann. Hello, Karen. Yeah, it, uh, we are still, I'm still 22 miles from Fort Smith, guys. Still not even out of Oklahoma yet. Why is that? And that's because we've been doing 55 miles an hour the whole entire time we've been on the interstate, except for the first 10 minutes we got on the interstate, guys. We uh, we loaded up from Jen and Wiley's over at Altruistic Farmstead, and we got back on the interstate, pulled in their trailer, which is behind us right there. And all of a sudden, just all of a sudden, I dropped water. There, my my truck immediately started overheating. It was pouring water out everywhere, smoking. Um, I coasted off of the interstate just enough into a gas station, and uh, where we set it there until it cooled down. I was able to add water back to the truck. It uh, it didn't didn't leak any water, but you know it's. It's still overheating. If I go over 60 miles an hour, I start overheating. Yeah, and Ann just asked if it was still overheating. It is, it is still overheating. If I go any faster than 60, you'll see the temperature uh, start to climb up. Maggie Creech is here. Hi. Hello, Maggie. Oh, speaking of which. Heather Hopper. Vivian Graham. T. McD. T. McD. We're almost home, guys. Not long now. Miss Karen said hi, Serenity. Hello. Mama Carolyn. Charlene Grady said, is your load too heavy for your truck? I like, uh, hello, Charlene. It may be, Charlene. Uh, That's what I thought, too. I'm pulling, a, I'm pulling Wiley's dump trailer, which, in my opinion, didn't seem very big, but it is loaded down with a bunch of tools and stuff, and I just don't think old Betsy can handle it. Auntie Ann said thermostat? Maybe. Um, I was actually talking to Randall uh, with Gypsy Trails. He's also part of the convoy of helping everybody move today. And uh, we were talking about that. It very well may be the thermostat. Yeah. Auntie Sarah's <laughs> back there. She's been uh, playing games and watching shows on her tablet. Yep. And that. Uh, She's also been a little occupied back there <laughs> with a little surprise. Yep. Tomorrow, uh, on tomorrow's episode of Dreaming with Drifters, there is going to be some huge news. New addition to DD5. You guys are going to have to wait until tomorrow to see that. <laughs> Auntie Ann said, or water pump. Yeah, it could be the water pump. I don't, I don't know, Auntie Ann, honestly. It's a uh, I'm not leaking any water or anywhere. Or, or, I, don't, I just don't know. I don't know. Hello, Mark. Courtney Chapel said, turn the heat wide open and high and hitch and, and hit and shut me down. You know, Uncle David, Uncle David would come on home setting said the same thing, but I got to be honest with you. We did that and rode, and it didn't help one bit. It didn't do anything. I'm actually riding right now with the air conditioning on and the windows up. Uh, I just have to keep it under 60. Look at all the motorcycles. Hey, Did you guys cool. hear them? Did you guys hear them? I'm sure y'all can hear all the traffic. <laughs> Miss Karen said, Sir, do you have any snacks for me? Yeah. What, kind said, of, yeah. what kind of snack <laughs> you got back there, Serenity? Joe? Are they all gone? No, there's a whole other <laughs> thing of them. Yeah, okay. uh -oh. 
temperature climbing. Not too bad. That's bad. Let me let me slow it on down to about fifty. It's probably the AC is not. It's not. It's not. Everything was just going fine. I was just going down the hill, and going down the hill, we picked up a little speed, and I did about sixty-five. Oh, my hands right here. Okay. She said yes, Max. Charlene said yummy. Oh, I'm trying to. I don't know if I'm, how far are you, how far are you left? Um, I am not exact sure on the mileage. Um, I know on a regular, on a regular drive, it's about an hour and 30 minutes from Fort Smith back to the house on a regular drive. But with us driving 50 miles an hour, it may be two hour drive before we make it back. Melissa, asked, do you have a coolant in the radiator? Um, at this point, there there is probably no more coolant in the radiator because it blew all the water out of it twice already. Oh, yeah, that was great. Barb said hello, Mike and Lissa and Mr. Renity. Hello. Miss Carolyn said, looks like the weather warmed up. Yeah, it's, yeah. It, it got, it's very hot. I Michael actually traded shirts. Yeah, I started <laughs> off with that shirt earlier, and I took my shirt off earlier. Michigan, live above the 45th parallel. Hey, hey guys. What's going on, Clarissa and Sizzle? Radio Jonesy, hey. Hey. Dennis Green, y'all were 30 miles from my house. Pray y'all make it back okay. Dang. <laughs> you know, Dennis Green, I actually, uh, if we would have been able to make better time and get back on the road a little faster, and and, and I'm glad now because we would have had trouble with the truck not knowing, but I did want to, that would have been cool to be able to come and see you and meet you. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, also, I was trying to get up with uh, with Dave and Sammy with Go Days, and after I was already on the road and losing service, I seen that Dave actually sent me a text with a different number. Said he he got, he got a different Hi. number, so that's why I called you several times, but obviously it went straight to voicemail. Hi, Auntie. Shelly said I didn't know they had Doritos. Yeah, those are new things. Press play. Hey, Hunter, love you. What's Hi. up, Hunter? Said he's at work. We're on our way back from Oklahoma. Mommy, show them the Doritos. The Doritos are small, like pinky. Who's that? Sir Paul Honeyman, I see in the chat. What's going on, Paul? Mommy, Karen said, What are you pulling on the trailer? That's what uh, they look like, guys. They're tinier than my pinky. The, it's a big dump trailer, slam full of tools and ladders and stuff like that. So Felix Denmark, hello, hello. Matt Casso said, "DD5, I agree with Auntie Anne. It's probably the thermostat. Good luck. You may need antifreeze so you don't overheat. Love you guys. Yep. I love you too, and thank you." Petta Jean River uh, Homestead, what's going on, Bobby? Thank you. Rest area ahead. We must be getting close to Arkansas. We got 170 people hanging out with us today. Thank you guys so much. On a Friday. Well, we, are getting, we are getting close to Arkansas because I remember that. The best spot we went to. The yeah. rest area? With the TPs over Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Cool. yeah, we did make a stop this morning. Uh, Daddy, uh, <laughs> yeah, I think that's actually where we filmed our Dreaming with Drifters today. We started off here. Stop every area. Get water. We uh, I do have about twenty bottles of uh, water in the back of the truck, just in case we do overheat and I need random water. Yeah, that is that's the same rest area we stopped at earlier. Yeah, that's the rest area. On the other side. Yeah, but oh yeah, it was on the other side. Uh, that's great. That's super chat, fifty dollars. Thank you. Thank you, safe. Thank you so much, Dennis. I appreciate that, brother. Thank you. That, that'll be going towards a new thermostat. <laughs> yeah, we, we left at 5 a.m. this morning. We were on the road. Well, about 10 minutes after 5. Charlene said, I love all that you guys are doing at, at your homestead. Thank you. Thank you, Charlene. Things are about to crank up and uh, get hot and heavy now that it feels a lot better outside and we can go out there without being cold and miserable and wet, wet and stuff. Hello, 
was the head gas. Yeah, Melissa, I hope so. I hope not either. But I mean, everybody's flying around us so quickly. We're literally doing 55 miles an hour in a 70 mile an hour zone. Hey, Daddy. Hey, hey, even the cops are just going past us so fast. What's up, sweetie? Guess what? What? The thing we're going to do tomorrow? Yes. Okay, so we got invited to a wedding slash uh, Greg and Gina baby shower. A wedding slash baby shower. We got invited to it and we're going how are things how are things up in up in that part of the world, Greg and Gina in New York? Hello? Wait, which part of New York? They're in North New York. I was on New York, New York. New York. That's all like New York, New York. Like North New York. Above New York City, I believe. So New York, New York. Yeah. There's only one New York. No. Nope. No one in Arkansas. There's not a New York in Arkansas. What is it? Just eat it. Oh. <laughs> you know, I'm tired. Tired? Why are you tired? You act like you got up at 4 a.m. Uh, I am a little tired also. It's been a heck of a day. I'm not. Dot Roper, hello. Dot Roper, hello, hello, dear. I am Daddy. I'm zero and a half tired. Zero and a half tired. Court, what's that? Courtney says I'm from Georgia. What's going on, Courtney? Georgia, 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 Georgia. I believe it's for um Brittany and um. Yes. Yep. Not ourselves. I do apologize to everybody if it's a little loud riding in the truck. Kind of going like this. Yeah, <laughs> bumping up and down with us. Be a bobblehead with us. A bobblehead. A bobble. Um, for boring car riders, guys. <laughs> We're usually blasting the radio. Yeah, yeah, we ride with the with the music blasting. Sometimes. Daddy, that, Daddy, you know, Daddy does this. He didn't do one. He didn't do one. Back roads eighty two said, "Howdy, looks like you all are making some good progress." What's going on, back road? Greg and Tina said, Mike, do you like the Ford or do you like the Ram better? Oh, I, I miss my Dodge so much. He misses the Dodge. I so still much. talk about that truck. <laughs> I miss my Dodge so much. He had a Facebook memory come up a couple weeks ago when uh, he first bought it. Yep. <laughs> yeah, I said I, I said I like the Dodge way better, 100% better. I mean, I am very... I am a hundred percent more grateful for the Ford than I was for that Dodge. Uh, but as far as just preference goes, oh man, I like my push button four wheel drive. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> That's right. Yeah, Melissa, mine was a big horn as well. Had the big 5.7 Hemi in a big horn. Feel like she'd pull a house down. My blinkers? Yeah. No, my blinkers are not on. Mommy Carolyn said, car rides can make you tired. Oh, yeah. We're not turning. Correct, Serenity. We're not turning. Correct. Melissa said, I love the car. You read the I'm behind. Behind. <laughs> I see David Moffat. I can't read what it said, but I see David Moffat just commented. What's going on, brother? Mommy, why did you I feel like we're on a boat ride like this. Mile marker three two one forty east over. 
Daddy, we want to go. Let's go. She had where she got the Hemi. Yeah, that Hemi is nice. And it was. Oh, Dennis Green is just telling me to talk about her. He can't hear me. I tell her that all the time, Dennis. I'm just a soft talker. Nine miles to Fort Smith. Mommy, you're like, I'm a soft talker, like, but like, when you were a baby, you're like, I'm just a baby. Somebody said hello from Toronto. Shirley said, I see no drift or down moments lately. Not lately. It's been a minute. It's been a minute. I'm proud of that, actually. I don't like uh, as long as you don't count old Betsy being drifted down. Betsy is a part of our family, so we have to. Did you find out what the, uh, David Moffat David had commented? I knew this was going to turn out to another jump to Jim Smith. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody's ahead of us, though. I believe everybody else is already in Arkansas, probably pretty close to uh, Jen and Wiley's place, getting ready to drop everything off. Marilyn Bryson said, did the rest of the convoy pass you? Yes. We started off an hour ahead of them. And Fox, Fox said, Captain, Captain Mike Smith loved his old stolen submarine. You better believe it, Paul. <laughs> Put that baby in four wheel. Dive, dive, dive. <laughs> Steve Walker said, hey, hey. Alyssa was the laughter about. Yeah. I think so. Yeah, she was. <laughs> I believe she was. Somebody, I believe it was Steve Walker said, hey, 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 the Brits are here. <laughs> Hey, there we go. We finally got over 200 people in the live. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with us on a Friday like today. That's because, are you connected to the Nomad? Yeah. We're still live streaming. Okay. Oh, to this phone. Yeah. Dennis Green said, saw that what? Come on, what? Oh, it's all that come on down moment, though. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. right? Steve Walker said SLR hit the ground yesterday. Dude, <laughs> I missed it. I'm a, I'm a, we're actually super behind on all the comments. Oh, I guess I put somebody's comment on the screen and didn't really mean to do Just touch it again, touch it, just touch it. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Oh, wow. I'm trying to like move it, but the road's so bumpy, so my thumb is like just hitting it. There's a green <laughs> thing right there, I believe. Just touch the green thing right here. David Moffat gets in five memberships. Thank you so much, David Moffat. We will be having uh, some member pictures going out, uh, I believe, tomorrow or Sunday, and a and a members only live coming out sometime next week. Steve Walker was gifted, Doc Roper, Cindy Brown, uh, West House. West House. Morning Chapel. Hello. As soon as you said Courtney's name, I see her dropping the member emojis. Uh -oh. Fort Smith National Historic Site. Next right. Now, here's the part I'm not exactly sure. Which exit do I get off? Do I get off of the first exit right here? I don't have the GPS on. I asked him about that before we started this. Well, I said that I, I knew where we were going until we got to Fort Smith. I don't know how many exits there are in Fort Smith. Let's see if I can pull it up. Oh, I believe this is the one because look, there's the Cherokee. Yeah. Remember? Okay. So this was our exit. So we'll remember that. <laughs> we should be able just to take, you know, the very next exit. Oh, Daddy, remember that little uptown Yep. Dad, the facade. I would rather not go downtown anyway. You know what I'm saying? I'd rather try to go around. I believe we should be able to get off a little closer to the airport and then take the back road home. Yeah. Airport. The airport. Yeah, they have an airport here. 
Melody Five asked a question. It's at the bottom. Where are you guys pulling behind you? I am pulling a dump trailer slam full of Jen and Wiley's tools and ladders and all kinds of stuff. All kinds of stuff. It's high. It's real tall. And because the front of it is a little elevated, now that it's on my on my ball hits, it's kind of down like this. I think I'm ready to. I think I'm ready to. Paul said, laugh out loud, last time I tried to use GPS, I threw it out of the window and went back to my map book and never used GPS again. That's right. That's right. I've had some bad moments with the GPS, too. I can't do anything, sweetie. I'm, right now, I'm driving down the road trying to pay attention to not only the road, but the other drivers around me and my trailer. Charles Buckford said, I hate to tell you, but you are looking at a blown head gasket. It's been through two, not cheap. Well, Charles, I hope that's not the case. Oh, you said what? Hello, Brooke Burks. I just noticed her. She was Brooke Burks, hey. what's up, yeah? But even if it is a, let me get, there we go. Even if it is a blown head gasket, it it won't be that big of a deal. We got uh we got friends that know how to do stuff like that. Matthew Evans said, "Where is the boys?" Oh, uh, you know where the boys are, Matthew. Talon and Jacob, opportunity to play video games. You already know. We uh we brought Serenity with us because she uh she was actually requested over at uh. Our mountain home. Yeah. Little Miss Lily over there, their daughter, requested Serenity. Yeah. <laughs> so our friends, uh, Jimmy. As we got there, Serenity jumped out the truck, and I, and I didn't see her until we were leaving again. <laughs> yeah. We got uh, our friends, Jamie and Kevin, with our works little field hanging out with us. What's up, guys? Daddy jumped us the truck. Sorry. Our little field I see trees, so you're in Arkansas. That's right. <laughs> yep. Daddy. What, baby? I know you filmed us on the trampoline. You tried to be sneaky. I saw you. Yep. I um I don't know if everybody has seen it or not, but we did just recently today, uh, not too long ago, about an hour ago, post our newest video. Numbers five, a uh, new edition of Shoot She with the Smiths <laughs> over there at Jen and Wiley's house. Um. I bet some of y'all were hoping it was defense. Yeah. <laughs> it's coming, guys. Yeah, Dennis Green, that's what I've been watching the whole time, really, is my temperature gauge, making sure that we don't get up there too close to the uh, to the H on the hot, trying to keep it out of red line. Um, but it seems to be doing a good job as long as I keep it under 60 miles an hour. Once I hit over 60 miles an hour, she starts to creep up. Actually, she's creeping up right now as we speak. Me ease off for a little bit. Cindy Brown said, "Between Gumpy, Drew, Wiley, and Gary, it won't take much to change them." No, yeah. <laughs> I won't lie. I'd rather not do it. Did you read Paul's? He said, "Easy way to check." No. Okay. Paul said, "Easy way to check a blown head gasket, Mike. Just take the oil filler cap off and see if you have a milky substance." Oh, okay. Uh, in that case, no. I have. Uh, I checked the oil. Actually, right after we had our first overheat and blew all the water out the very first time, uh, oil still looks good. So that's good. That's good news. Then. Yeah. I appreciate that, Paul. That's a good way to know. That's the same thing uh, Wiley asked me earlier. He asked me if I had water uh, or looked like water in my oil or milky stuff in my oil. I told him no. Looks like yeah, I uh, I checked the radiator and everything uh, earlier, David Moffat, but there were no leaks I could find or anything like that. Yeah, I'm thinking it. Everybody seems to be thinking it's the thermostat or works little field. Daddy. Yes, ma'am. 
Back there, I saw two girls stuck. Charlie Grady, where are you now? Where am I now? I am at mile marker 330.5. Are we in Arkansas? Uh, yeah, we're in Arkansas. I'm actually getting ready to get off this interstate for Dora, Fort Smith, South. Actually, there's the sign right there that says, Welcome to Arkansas. 36.5. That doesn't look like we're moving. Sit for a second, let's down a second. Here. There's the sign that says welcome to Arkansas. So I guess technically we're we're not in Arkansas yet. <laughs> technically, maybe. Fort Smith that way. Fort Smith this way. I don't know if we're supposed to go here, baby. I'm just I'm just going. I'm just going the way I feel that my ancestral guides are taking me. We've been down here before. We have never been this way. I can promise you that. Oh, yeah. Railroad tracks. Railroad tracks. Yeah, yeah, we have. Serenity. I remember the train thing. Baby, we've never been down this road. Never. We've never even been on that interstate before from that direction. Serenity, you're tripping. I'm not. You're arguing just the sake to argue. Will you drop this down and spin it over there? I remember this. Serenity, listen to what I'm saying. We have never been there. Do you hear what I'm saying? We've been down there. Remember where we passed our exit? That's where we were. We've never been down here. <laughs> it all looks the same. It just okay. looks the same. <laughs> Michigan Life above the 45th parallel. Well, just gifted five eighty-five membership. Nice, thank you guys so much. Casey's Kitchen Creation got one. Hey, hey. Hey, Casey. Hey, Dorian H got one. T McD, Brooke Burks, and Heather Hopper. Uh, was it Cassie's Kitchen's Creations? Yeah, Cassie. I'm sorry. Cassie's Kitchen Creations. She's a She's a, I don't know if she's a new YouTuber or not, but I know that uh, she's new to us, new to me. And uh, I tell you what, if you guys haven't, oh, look at a cop right here. <clears throat> I don't know what the speed limit is. But if you guys haven't seen her channel or uh, anything like that, oh yeah, stay tripping trying to bust somebody. Beep, you should definitely go over there and check her out. She is cooking up a storm. Oh yeah. He's all blending in, trying to bust somebody. You ain't busting me. I'm doing 55. <laughs> there a car behind you? What? I Was there a car behind you before? Uh, no. There's cars back there now. I'm hoping this is going to bring me out on like the north side. And we'll be able to like turn east. Brooke Burke said, "DD5, you can always go to Ozark and head south towards Paris." Yep. Yeah, that would have been an option as well. I think I'm. I think I'm on the right track. Thank Kevin. Yes, we have. Everything's good. What is it? Yes, that we've been in touch with the kid at that. Yeah, Talon has a phone. Talon got his own phone line for Christmas, so he's able to call. And uh, we do call on him every uh, couple of hours to check, make sure kids are good, the dogs are good. Yeah. Somebody did another super chat? I see it right there. Dennis Green, $5. Hey, Serenity, go get you an ice cream. Hey. Thank you. Thank you. Gene G. I, know I see Drew's Lens hanging out. What's Thank going you. on? I said driving can't can't chat, but love you. We love you too, love brother. You. RK Wilson became a drifter. Thank you so much. Thank you. I'm, I'm dropping speed. My little, uh, hey, my little girl. <laughs> Daddy, 
David Moffat said, Andrew's glance, keep your eyes open. They may need a toe. Not that the house. They might. Close up, please. Put it in front of you. Wet paint. Wet paint. What in the world? We're pulling this big old trailer. I ain't got time for this. <laughs> See, Trooper got somebody down there. What in the world? Uh, it's like we're getting back on that. This is not what I was trying to do. Yeah. Rocker NJ, what's going on? Sorry, guys, I'm not paying attention to the comments at a second. Why not? Because I'm being nosy and I want to know what's happening around me. Because Michael's got his lost. I don't have his lost. Yeah, you do. Uh, Fort Smith is one mile away. We're not lost. There's another state trooper up here. I am not lost. Yeah, have you been here? Fort Smith? Yeah, we've been to Fort Smith a bunch of times, sweetie. I've never been on this particular road before. She said, y'all running good, DD5. Yeah, we're still looking good. Temperature is normal where it's supposed to be. Mama Carolyn said, Serenity, what's your favorite ice cream? Mm. Chocolate chip. Chocolate chip. <laughs> I like butter pecan. Uh oh. Serenity. Serenity. Yeah. What does that sign say? Arkansas. Welcome, Ooh, to Arkansas. welcome to Arkansas. We made it back. Made it back. But where are we coming into? Fort Smith. The side of Fort Smith. Chocolate chip. On the uh, side. My favorite ice cream is chocolate chip. <laughs> I get aggravated with him sometimes, guys. I ain't gonna lie. I do. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you where we're at. It's not it's not uh, that is a good possibility, Serenity. Hey, can somebody get rid of Daniel Burden, please? I had to block him from my other channel, and now he's making an appearance here. And I don't want to explain anymore. He's just not very nice. And I'm tired of reading his comments and dealing with him. Thank you. Moderators, handle that. Please. Bye, Felicia. Bye. It feels well. Welcome to Fort Smith. Yeah, I wasn't trying to come up downtown. Mommy, we've been here. Yeah, we have been here. This is the road we were... Oh, this no. is where Daddy did not want to come That's to. Exactly right. That's exactly <laughs> and right. And now we're here. We are here. Downtown. At least we know we're almost home. Yes, sweetie. Like you hour. are correct. Like an hour. Oh, I didn't want to deal with this. I was trying to catch the outskirts. But it does. It's crazy that y'all cracking me up. Love y'all get on. <laughs> <laughs> Mama Carolyn said that's her favorite too, Serenity. Chocolate chip or pecan? Chocolate chip, I think. Butter pecan. But I like chocolate chip. Chocolate How do I make David Moffat a... I thought he was a moderator already. You are not uh, watching it from DD5, so you can't make anybody a moderator. Uh, you have to be... You're watching it Dreaming of Drifters. We'll work on that, David Moffat. <laughs> <coughs> he said, he said, make me a mod and he will disappear. <laughs> Daddy. This yes. place looks like from a straight movie. Looks like a what? This place looks like it came from a straight movie. <laughs> a straight movie. It's a Randy. Feels like she's in a movie, guys. Yeah. In a movie. <laughs> Hi, 
I do like the look of downtown, though. Downtown yeah. Force Mayor. And all the artwork. Yeah, the all the art and stuff on the building. I, I don't like know it. how people get that. That thing. That one's really pretty. Mom, you sure saw a butterfly one. What time is it? 6 35. See, the, the thing is, is I know I'm supposed to turn somewhere, right? I mean, I, I know I am. <laughs> I'm going to put it in my GPS. Why don't you do that? <laughs> Why don't you do that? Look at this beautiful church. Look at the architecture on this joker. Immaculate Conception Catholic Parish. Yeah, that that's sucker beautiful. is nice. It too. Check out the statues. Bad bitch too. Yeah, it's big. 338 people hanging out with us on the live. Thank y'all so much. Hey, it was ten. Are you to I just turned right here. He's South 14th Street. Three quarters of a mile. And then make a right, right? I got it now, guys. <laughs> I know, I know right where I'm at. I'm right here by Cousin's Guitar Shop. <laughs> Mom, Daddy, Mommy. Yes. I had a Dorito. Was it you, good? You had a Dorito. Sweet. We just passed a burrito bowl. Speaking of burrito bowls, uh, Jen made some bomb. Uh, you could call them fajitas if the shells would have been hot, but they were pretty much tacos. <laughs> uh, they were supposed to be fajitas. Uh, it was still bomb either way. It was pork and chicken. She had cilantro, cheese, lettuce, a bunch of vegetables that worked. Rice. Some rice. Yep. Oh, hi, Tasha. Tasha Lynn, what's going on? Hi, Tasha. Alyssa said, love my ice cream. Maggie said, ha, 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 Mike. Yeah. <laughs> Daddy, it's probably the classic plan. What road uh, are we turning on, my queen? My navigational queen? Oh, turning, uh, not going anywhere straight so it actually seems like i picked the very exact road i was trying to pick is where i ended up going look at that i uh, hey we don't have to turn anywhere this is straight going all the way past where the airport's gonna go and this is gonna be the back way it's gonna drop us into the back side of boonville and everything this is exactly where i was trying to go huh huh y'all like that like that Daddy, I still didn't want to come downtown. So this on. green with another super chat, twenty dollars super chat. I'm trying to see what it said. Oh yeah, and by the way, bang bang Niners gang. Bang bang Niners gang. Daddy, you gotta touch it. Bella, touching it. Bella, it's let it go away, guys. It's still there. No, touch the super chat itself. Nope, the small one. There you go. Bang, bang. Bang, bang. There's this really, uh, there's, there's, this, there's this truck behind us. We are not going through the city. <laughs> I drew. <laughs> drew, we're downtown, baby. We're downtown. We ain't even, uh, messing. We ain't messing around. You know that song? Downtown. Da, 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 da. Daddy, Down. you should know this song. Don't stop. Don't stop. Believe We listened to that on the way here. <laughs> Hold on to the feeling. Uh, Our mountain home. Howdy, everyone. What's up, Jen? Wiley. Why y'all didn't tell us where? Uh, which way to go? <laughs> <laughs> got me driving through downtown Fort Smith. You know what kind of situation we got going on. Daddy? <laughs> Clarissa said Sizzle just got home. Sizzle, what up, brother? Daddy. After a hard day at the Tesla. What is it, sweetie? I have a 
Happy, happy birthday, birthday, Natasha. Oh, happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, happy birthday. Happy birthday. birthday. How about you sing the regular song? Happy birthday, 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 dear Natasha. Happy, happy birthday, birthday, birthday to you. Because she had already started singing the other one. True enough. What? Oh, oh, you missed the whole verse. <laughs> yeah, sorry. It's for today is your birthday. That's what I've been told. What a wonderful birthday. You're one four years old. Yep. On the cake will be candles lighted for you. And the whole world is singing. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Natasha. Happy birthday to you. I added a part. I love you. Nobody asked to hear our thing. Hey, the people that were in the next in the truck right there, the young guy and girl, the girl just looked out the window and pointed at the camera and she I seen her mouth like you too. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. We are live with DD Uh oh. Uh -oh. Speaking of ice cream, look, there's Brom. Tasha said I love it. Saving this video forever. Thank y'all. <laughs> <laughs> we love you. We hope you have a good birthday. Okay. Hey, look, another old school truck, F100. Uh, remember when I used to ride side by side like that with you? I do. She's all in the guy's arm, you know, while he's driving. <laughs> remember when I had a truck? That, well, you could do that with this truck. You could put this up because there's a seatbelt in the middle right here. Guys, I put it Uh oh, we're passing the mall. Passing the mall. Yep. Later. Right there. Can you swing that back over there, please? Do you see how he just tells me what to do all the time? Well, you're blinding our friends. Cindy Brown, what's going on, dear? How's it going, sister? That's right, bench seats for the wifey. Okay. Get a pajama coat. Listen, run in there in the auto zone and grab us the thermostat real fast. If I knew that exactly what it was, which it probably is, but if I knew exactly that's what it was, I would go ahead and do that. Oh, no. Traffic. Traffic, 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 traffic. Oh, no. Traffic. I almost forgot what traffic was like. I know. I'm not living in you know what? Our, listen, tell <laughs> tell everybody what our idea of traffic is. <laughs> like five cars on our dirt road. <laughs> if we three, our magic number is three. If we see more than three cars driving around at one time on the dirt road, we're like, man, look at all this traffic. I Ninja Japanese Express. Sushi and hibachi. So look, we could have took 40 to right here and we could have skipped all this is what I wanted to do, but I guess you made me get off on this exit. Oh, look, 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 in a quarter there was somebody of laying in the ground over there. Add me a little prayer. Oh, my love. Are you going to run this light? No, we ain't going to run it. We ain't going to run it. Dang, look at the Hooters. I ain't seen the Hooters in so long. I didn't even know they still had Hooters. 369 people hanging out with us. Thank you so much. Anona Milton, what's going on, fam? Poof. Mommy. Yes, ma'am. Red coat. Huh? Red coat. Red coat. Red coat. Oh, 
Careful, that's a... We're just going to continue straight on right with it, Rogers. Yeah, the sun's coming to the back there. Arby's. We have <laughs> Leave some space. It's not a race. Put your phone down. I don't have my phone. My phone's up there. Daddy. I ain't touching. Daddy. Yes, ma'am. Chick-fil-A, we have the chicken doggies. Yeah. Really, I like Chick-fil-A. I think Chick-fil-A is... Uh, it's uh, it's their slogan. It's their unofficial slogan. Is uh, the Lord's chicken? That's the Lord's chicken. McAllisters. Oh, we haven't had a McAllisters in a while. In a while, got some bomb diggity sandwiches there. I like their uh, I've ever had potatoes. Oh yeah, their big spuds. Daddy, have you ever had that? That's okay. Mommy. Thank you. Daddy. Big, um, Coke. Yeah, I know every time we got to Arby's, they're going to go, Arby's, we have the meat. So I said we have. I wonder if this lane merges. I don't think it does. It should be two lane all the way up. Uh, yeah. People have to continue on State Highway 22 East. There's nowhere to keep left. Continue on State Highway 22 East for 20 miles. Toothless. Olive Garden. Right there. Sorry, now we're in town. Daddy. I'm just going to start randomly no, no, no. saying How about we just go ahead and say, wrap it up. Since we're in town and we need to focus a little more. Okay. I guess. You're so bossy. Always telling me what to do, making me do stuff. Somebody has to. They're always trying to tell other people what to do. Well, it's like 647. All right, guys. Well, we hope you have a great weekend. There's Lowe's. That's where you bought your flowers. Yeah. Hope every yeah, hope everybody has a wonderful time. Great day. Woo, got some. Don't forget, if you haven't seen the newest video on DD5 today, we get a new episode of Shooting the Sheet loading up. You guys get to see what I'm pulling, see how we got it hooked up and everything. And don't forget on tomorrow's episode of Dreaming with Drifters, we're going to have a huge, huge surprise for you guys. Something brand new has come to the landing. Man, it's exciting. <laughs> and if you're not subscribed to DWD, head on over there and subscribe it's coming out it's coming out we love you guys be good we're gonna try our best to maybe Alyssa will let me get out of this town without hurting me i don't know <laughs> and don't forget love y'all always do the banana split <laughs> serenity tell our friends remember if you can dream it you can do it bye we need a split you got to end the live.